Greetings everyone, this is Russian2753, and I'm starting another episode of Geopolitical Simulator 4, and that looks like a Russian airplane just launched a missile into northern Syria. Oh wow, that's a big hit. Set people or not. I've lost track of my diplomacy. And let's see. We talked to diplomats from Peru, Lithios, and Ecuador, I think. I think we talked to all these people. Did I hit these guys? Didn't make a point. And then, um. Who else can we come? They can introduce us to some other people. That's what I'm really interested in right now. Being introduced to groups. This looks like a major. Wow. That looks like a major engagement. It's like a shot. So it's almost like there's like there's so many different factions involved in this conflict. Which is one of the things that makes it very confusing. And the Russians are now attacking the total jihad groups. I should probably try to make gains on other groups. So I'm thinking I should attack the most brother. Uh, but I'm worried if that's going to upset anybody. And it looks like we have wiped out another camp. Time to get these forces involved in the Battle of Ranka. Looks like we control, we have complete control over that area now. Forces can continue to advance. There's our mercenaries. Let's get these mercenaries out. I'd actually like these mercenaries. Yeah, let's get the mercenaries into that city. Confirm. And I'm going to go ahead and move about half of my extremists out here. Extending our grip. Oh, it looks like one of our rebel camps has been revealed here. Let's get some troops out of here. Take out about half of the troops. And let's move them into that city. Yeah, that's why you have to stay mobile, I guess, because these camps will be found. advance the pickup trucks out here, 132 miles, we might be able to uh, reinforce the base. Alright, so, into the city. Again, we've occupied a lot of territory here. Police headquarters. Let's make an assault on the police headquarters here.
station. That was definitely a tougher fight. But we do have control and they got there uh, prematurely it looks like. Okay, there is some um, action going on. This diplomat, I am going to offer you coffee to start. Sure. Dark and strong, please. And, um, let's see. Let's see if they'll fund the organization. I'm sorry, but we still disagree on some point. I guess not. And, uh, will they supply some I'm weapons? sorry, but we still disagree. Okay, so nothing going on there. Maybe I can bribe some of these people. It's tempting. But we have to weigh up the pros and cons. We mustn't ignore the consequences. Okay, of can't problem. A bird in the hand is worth two in the bush. But on the other hand, once you get mixed up in that sort of thing, in short, at Stay the end of the day. Clean, huh? No fun. Alright. What happened here? Our men have stormed the city center. Looting the bank. Ooh, look at that. All 3 the cash and gold million. reserves. It's a godsend and really will be of great benefit to us. That's a godsend. And the last holdout seems to be... ...in the regional parliament. So let's go ahead and get all our troops... ...out there. Get them all into that town square... ...with the reinforcements. And, um... ...concentrate before we make this assault. nearby. Let's pull them out. Oh, tons of reinforcements just came in from the north. Alright. Here is the town square. With these guys. forces together to make an assault on the regional parliament. Alright, that should take care of things. Looks like uh, only infantry can go into the buildings, which makes sense, so that's good. Take the regional parliament. Taking the city of Ranka. Very 
very good. Who are we sure. talking? Turkey? Dark and strong, please. You can say I love your country. I hope you didn't make eh. Okay, ask us to put in contact with the Georgian Socialist Democratic Union. No problem. I intended to do that very anyway. Very good. <coughs> now we're talking, we're getting in contact with Georgia. Mm, yeah. Now they want to give us money. Well, at least we get the contact with them. That is significant. Alright, and we've captured uh, one of the cities here. Looks like there's two more cities in this province that we should go after. It looks like there's a lot of success. Another battle seems to be emerging. This one between Syria and the Jihadist Caliphate. Okay. At one point we're going to have to attack the Syrian government itself. The question is when. They are being supported by, looks like they're getting support by the Russians. So, uh, that could be dangerous. I don't know where the Russians are. Maybe they have an aircraft carrier or something in the area. I know the United States has an air base up here in Turkey. So we're not going to upset the Turks. Jihad is still losing that battle for sure. <coughs> A couple pickup trucks left. Eh, that can be tough. And this battle. Total Jihad is also losing. <coughs> They're definitely going to get wiped out here. Okay, so we have captured our first two bases. The question again is going to be when do we actually move against the Muslim Brotherhood? And um, it might be soon. Made pretty good advances in the West. Or the East, sorry. Definitely capture an entire province here. I think I'm going to set up a base. Looks like they're building a base. Are they building a base? I don't know. Consider uh, how we want to take. See how that turns out, and then we'll see how uh, we want to consider moving on other provinces. We're gonna have to capture this province from the Syrian government. Ooh, what are we at here? Yeah, we're probably gonna start moving a little quicker. All right. Well, so far so good. Hope you guys enjoy. episode and uh, I'll see you guys next time